This week's Ask Dr. Dury uh, comes from a patient who has a very simple question, but an important question. How important is sleep for myeloma patients, or actually for anyone really? And the answer to that question is extremely important. It is very, very important to get good, regular sleep, to maintain your immune system, to maintain your body health. The myeloma patient is challenged with many different issues which can disturb that healthy sleep pattern that we all need. There can be pain, there can be uh, GI issues which can be problematic, there can be uh, a variety of things that are going on which are creating worry, anxiety, concern, will the treatment work, uh, what are the next steps, lots of issues that need to be addressed uh, and may be disturbing a good night's sleep. And so don't be shy about bringing this up with your doctor and with your care team and say, look, now I'm having trouble getting a good night's sleep. And take a look at all these different factors that may be disturbing your sleep pattern. Think about pain, think about other issues, think about medications. Obviously, as we all know, dexamethasone, a steroid, can interrupt the uh, sleep pattern and so talk to your doctor, maybe reducing the dose or maybe even eliminating the dexamethasone for a period of time may be helpful in re-establishing a good sleep pattern. Uh, in addition, uh, your doctor may prescribe a mild sedative to help establish a new uh, sleep pattern. And then you yourself must look closely at what are you doing through the day. It's, it's good to avoid a lot of naps during the day so that you are truly ready for sleep at night. Also in the evening, it's good not to be eating very late, to not be doing uh, a lot of complicated things into the late evening. You should be winding down steadily, trying to get a little more calm so that you are truly ready to go forward, uh, to get to bed and have a good night's sleep. And so, bottom line, do not hesitate to talk about the need for a good night's sleep with your doctor. Work through the different factors that may be important in your case and uh, talk to your care team about different ways uh, that this can be managed to really improve the situation. So, uh, very, very important question.